हेलो गाइज दिस नेडमिस्ट एंड आई नो टुडे नो फेस कैम आई एम क्वाइट बोर्ड ऑफ दैट इट्स बीन इन पास वीडियो सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डू अ प्लास्टिक अनबॉक्सिंग एज लाइक इट्स बीन अ वाइल आई हैव नॉट अनबॉक्स एनी प्लास्टिक बेबलेट सो येस टुडे वी आर डूइंग गोइंग टू डू अ प्लास्टिक अनबॉक्सिंग एंड टुडे इज बेबलेट इज नन अदर दैन वोल्टिक एप विच इज ओन्ड बाय डंगा ही इज फ्रॉम द वी फोर सीरीज दिस इज लाइक क्वाइट ओल्ड नाउ I think so. This is 2002, so it's really old now. So this is the box. The box looks quite shiny still. If you can see properly, the box looks awesome. And uh, let's take a look at the best thing in this, which is a magnetic core disc, which you get with this. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, with this Beyblade. So without any further talking, let's unbox this. Uh, there is a plastic cut there. Yeah, it's open. Uh -huh. So, right in the box, we do get the sticker sheet here. It's been a while now doing a plastic unboxing, and uh, it really feels nice as I always say. Plastic unboxings are uh, cool, and uh, there are really great parts in it. so basically there is nothing in this package except this uh, sticker of a turtle so we we'll leave that aside the instruction set which is not uh, important the sticker sheet which is very important and give looks to the beyblade so we'll keep it here and let's see what else is there in the box yes the very beautiful frame which we get with the plastic generations and has stopped now in the burst as the parts have reduced to 3 for the simplistic design and it's quite lame i would say but still anyways we can still unbox the old plastic gens like this which are quite expensive but yeah it's fun so let's take out all the parts and uh, let's see what we have here so here is the magnetic disc which is wow really black i would say and there is a small cut here i don't know why is that cut it's on both the sides so i'm not sure what does that symbolize but fine uh, this is the ar or the attack ring you can see the two monkeys on apes i would say on the opposite sides the red colored apes which looks awesome this is the support ring here which uh, goes on the blade base uh, this is the blade base itself with a uh, metal tip which is pointed and obviously it's a stamina type then uh let's take a look at the rest of the parts which are the bit chip which we will take just one the clips which are also cool very important i would say and the secondary clip is uh so the clips then the spin gear parts mm yep so yeah and i do have uh, like real enjoyment in unboxing such beyblades rather than the burst base uh, in the today generation that's why i'm not unboxing much of the burst base but uh, stay tuned and soon i will be unboxing yamiterias which i had got recently so this is the spin gear here it kind of looks worn out i would say uh, the plastic is getting a uh, the foiled metal is getting removed actually and the inner uh, magnetic part is getting exposed if you can see as it's quite old you know so you can't blame it it's not focusing right i would say uh no it's not focusing leave it so let's take a look at this and i would just uh, assemble the beyblade quick so we would like i would be right back oh as you can see the magnetic part sticks to the metal weight here so i would be right back and assemble the beyblade stay tuned uh, guys. yes guys i am back uh, i thought i would just uh, keep on doing the assembly as the video continues so here is the process going on uh, it's fun to assemble with you guys so that's the blade base in position now with the uh, support ring i would say now how to put the support ring i doubt it it's like this no 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 it's uh, the other side yep so we have to put the 
damn it's so uh, tedious but uh, really enjoyable yep so the support ring is in place now as you can see it's in place and uh, let's put the magnetic disc which uh, instantaneously sticks to the magnetic core of the Beyblade which is really 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 cool uh, it's quite uh, rare in uh, very less Beyblades so let's just put the attack ring on yep and twist it so this is the Beyblade completed and let's put the bit chip on so that would just complete the Beyblade so here you have it guys Voltic Ape without uh, any stickers or any flashy things so stay tuned guys I would just put the stickers on and be right um, back yes guys I'm back so I just want the flashlight on the phone so to make it like quite bright so let's take a look at the parts now so this is the layer now oh my god it looks amazing with the stickers I would say brand new and fresh all the stickers available completely unscathed and amazing so this is the main part of this Beyblade which is the magnetic disc which uh, is mainly used uh, in the magnetic stadium and uh, gives that crazy movement to the Beyblades it was a stadium uh, in the plastic generation at that time so this is the support part of the blade base and this is the blade base with the magnetic weight or the metal weight you can say which is magnetic in nature so let's put the Beyblade together guys and it's awesome like seriously awesome I can't uh, I'm just uh, enjoying it uh, like uh, as you can see like when you put it uh, south up it doesn't go in properly it uh, comes out as you can see it, it will bounce outside if I try to put it it will go bounce and if I put uh, in the north direction it goes in uh, easily it's kindly the uh, kind of I think so the magnetic attraction and the forces repelling and attracting it so let's put the Beyblade together yes so guys this is it the Voltic Ape which is owned by Danga and it is uh, Kai's ultimate rival in V-Force so this is the Beyblade and uh, stay tuned guys for the next unboxing which I am going to have and which is going to be a Beyblade Burst unboxing a limited release unboxing so stay tuned guys for that and uh, take care and bye bye